When Krishna was about to appear in the Umbhakti Yogi, it is the prayer. Demigas prayer. Maschasya kachsapa nusinga paraha hansaradana viprabhibudhi sukudar dhara tampasi nasti vanancha dhadhane sabharam bhubara jaduttama bandhana unko. O jaduttama obesta jadu dynasty. You appear in many, many incarnations, Masya incarnation, fish, karma, tortoise incarnation, varaha, bhur incarnation, hayagriva, harsha, hayagriva incarnation, rishingha, eh? hansha, bamana, balaram, ramachandra, buddha, karki, etc. Eh? They are all lila avataras. Hmm? Yeah. Assume all these various lila avataras appear here in this material world to annihilate the demons, those who have great burdens on Mother Earth, thereby lessen her burden. Therefore, we all offer our obeisances to you repeatedly. Lambhata Mata Rupa Goswami has said, Paravastha Vatar Sargunyam Paripurita Hmm. Six types of opulences in whom you find is known as Parabhastavata, that is all opulence, all strength, all fame, all beauty, all knowledge, detachment, renunciation. These six types of opulences, huh? 
इस पर अवस्थवतार सी आर पर अवस्थवतार नृसिंह रामचंद्र कृष्ण दिस थ्री दिस सिक्स टाइप मेन्स आर कम्प्लीटली फोर दो दिस थ्री आर पर अवस्थवतार स्टिल कृष्ण इज भगवान इन लोगबार का मृत खोटी स्टेटमेंट्स बिल्लम भंगा रूप को स्वामी प्रभु से संतुवतार अभव पुष्कर नावस सर्वोत भद्रा कृष्णादन्य कुबलता सभी प्रेम तो भगवती जो पद्मनाभ दैट मींस नुज नाभ लोटस विद स्टेन स्प्रॉट इस पद्मनाभ आह मैंने मैंने अब तारस और स्पीशस अब तारस क्यों कृष्ण इस भगवान हो इवन गिव्स प्रेम तू एक क्रीपर नमः गिव्स प्रेम और कृष्ण गिव्स एंड स्पेशल कैरेक्टरिस्टिक ऑफ कृष्ण अब तार इस दैट राम और नरसिंह के डीमंस मैंने डीमंस बट नन ऑफ देम कट मुक्त दे those who are killed by ram and nrsingh they are not gotten much good they gain were born again again they were born as demons are great pantheists but those who are killed by krishna or killed in the battlefield of kurukshetra seen krishna they all got much they all got much this is the special category of krishna दो दिस थ्री आर रावस्तवता कृष्णा इज वेरी ब्यूटिफुल सोर्स ऑफ ऑल ब्यूटी हाँ माधुर्य का निर्णय वेरी स्वीट मगनानिमस हाँ मूर्ति एस इज ब्यूटिफुल स्वीट सुंदरली मगनानिमस आल्सो समाहल Ah, think of Krishna. But as your mind to Krishna, even Krishna is the object of love. If he, if someone develops love for Krishna, the only object of love, then he can think of always because he is the only object of love, most beloved. Also, how the stupid mind can think of unless one is most beloved. So Krishna is most beloved, only object of love. So develop love for Krishna, then you'll be able to think of Krishna constantly, day and night for twenty-four hours. Thus, some demons, especially Kansa, was very much afraid of Krishna. Therefore, he was thinking of Krishna day and night. It's only because of fear, because of fear. You understand? Therefore, Kansa is known as Bhayavatara in incarnation of fear. Bhayavatara, ah, you understand? So some of those who have thought of Krishna, they have all gotten mukti pada. Singa batar comes in chakshu samanantara after kurma batar. So you'll find you see some kind of bhagavatam. Hmm. This is some of the singa batar. Hmm. So we'll read from that chapter. सेवन एट ट्वेल्व जस्तया मंद भाग्या मद अन्यो जगदीश्वर वासो यदि सर्वत्र कस्मा स्तंभे न दृश्य If he is everywhere, then why is he not present before me in this pillar? Even the Kasuri father of Prahlad publicly declared, "He is Bhagwan. Who is Bhagwan? I am Bhagwan. Who is Bhagwan? Greater than me?" Prahlad said, "No, Bhagwan is Bhagwan. Nobody will be equal to him. Nobody is the greater. He is of all pervaded everywhere." Eh? Then he said. Is he that? Huh? His son, Prahlad Maharaj Vaishnav, hmm? Hiranyakashipu employed appointed Sundar and Amar Kattu teachers to teach Prahlad politics 
crookedness, nasty things, have to uh, divide and rule. Sāma, dāna, bheda, gundo. Uh, these are the principles of ruling class. Uh. Sāma, dāna, dāna, bheda, niti. Uh, Sometimes they will pass by somebody that gives some charity thereby bring him into control, then sometimes inflicting punishment, subdue, or sometimes they divide. Then two parties fight and third party is ruin the world. Samadana Dhanda Bhedaniti. This is a politics, political party. <laughs> so he appointed Sanda Marka two teachers to teach people, teach Prahlad Maharaj, his son, this, but Prahlad Maharaj from the Bhatta Vaishnav. When he was in Mother Sum, uh, he, he got opportunity to hear from Narada Muni and Sadhu and from Viri Bhatta, uh, he is Vaishnav. You understand? So, when he was a boy, he started speaking about Supreme Lord. All his classmates, demon boys, he taught him this not to. Then it is. And uh, noticed, it was noticed that all demon boys are becoming Vishnu Bhaktas. So oh, this is danger. What is this? <laughs> so the two teachers, Sanda and Amarka, uh, reported it to Hiranyakashipu. Otherwise they are heading to Kadak. So we are teaching this thing, but this boy is not taking this lesson from us. And he is speaking about Lord Vishnu, not doing these things. All demonia boys turning Vishnu Bhaktas. You understand? Then, Hiranya Kaswa asked his boy, called his boy, allowed him to sit on his lap, patted him, alive, what you have learned, speak my voice. Then he spoke about Lord Vishnu, Krishna. Then he got angry. What is this? Who is that Vishnu? Krishna, Supreme Lord? I am Lord. He is greater than I. People are no. Supreme Lord is supreme. Nobody is greater, nobody is equal to him, he is all provided. Huh? You better surrender unto him. <laughs> Much more angry. What is that? He is greater than me, he is all perfect everywhere. Is he here? In this pillar? Then this verse he says. Soham vikathamanasya sirakaya dharamite gopayeka Haristvadya zaste saranam sitam. Time of divorce is not one of them. Rain has come, this demoniac person should be devastated, killed, definitely let Nusinga Deva fear and kill all this demoniac person. Then there will be peace in the world, otherwise there will be no peace. This time is coming, yes. This Nusinga Deva's mercy, yes. all the demons will be killed, yes. Devastated, yes. That one time rain, unexpected time, such this is symptom of devastation, yes. All crops will be destroyed, no more availability of food, grains they will all dry, all die. Yes. Because you are speaking so much nonsense, mm. I shall now sever your head from your body. Mm. Now let me see your most worshipful God mm. come to protect you. Mm. I want to see it. I want to see you. Oh, yeah. can protect you. Satyam vidhatu nita bhutya bhasidam vyaptin ca bhuti su akhali su chatmana adrusya tatya dhuta rupam udvaham stambhi sabaya nabrugam namansam to prove that the statement of his servant, Prahlad Maharaj, was substantial, mm. in other words, to prove that the Supreme Lord is present everywhere, mm. even within the pillar of an assembly hall, mm. the Supreme Personality of Godhead, Hari, exhibited a wonderful form never before seen. Mm. The form was neither that of a man nor that of a lion. Mm. Thus the Lord appeared in his wonderful form mm. in the assembly hall. Mm. You understand? Wonderful form. How can one understand Supreme Law? Huh? He can assume any form. Any form as he likes. Yes. You understand? His eyes were reddish. Yes. This is what I say. Immense. Immense. A thousand. 
teeth fearful, huh? strong like sharp razor, huh? his uh, nostrils and let's say mouth like mountain scape, yes, appearing like mountain scape, yes, so great his body was touching sky, huh? Do you understand? And the hairs on his body as white as eh, moon, moon sign, yes. His arms were very long, appearing like swords of the soldiers, yes. Hidanakasu thought of who is this wonderful form. The eh? Lord appeared to kill me, but who can kill me? I am the Lord. Eh? Thinking like that, uh, lifted a club and started attacking the Lord. So there was fires fighting between Hiranyakashipu and Nishinga. At last, Vishwakspurantam Grahanaturam Harit Vyalo Dutha Kunkuli Sakhyatvattocham Dwari Urum Apatya Udar Lilaya Nakhe Tatahi Garuda Mahavi, some seven, eight, twenty nine. As a snake captures a mouse, or mm. Garuda captures a very venomous snake, mm. Lord Nasinga Day captured Hiranyakashipu, mm. who could not be pierced even by the thunderbolt of King Indra. Mm. As Hiranyakashipu moved his limbs here, there, and all around, very much afflicted at being captured, mm. Lord Nasinga Day placed the demon on his lap, supporting him with his thighs, mm. and in the doorway of the assembly hall, mm. the Lord very easily tore the demon to pieces mm. with the nails of his hands. Mm. Yeah, he had gotten that boon. He believed Brahma and got a boon. And he asked for uh, immortality, boon of immortality. Brahma said, I am not immortal. <laughs> I'll die. How can I go into this bowl? Round about me. He got all right. I'll, I'll not be killed by any demigod or human being or anybody. Not killed by any weapon. Killed in daytime or night time. Huh? Not killed inside the room or outside the room. Not killed in the land or water or sky. Huh? In this way. Not with any weapons, I'll kill. Huh? So in a roundabout way, immortality granted a light. Brahma granted this boon. Thought of, yes, I am not immortal. But what is impossible for the Supreme Lord? Huh? So he appeared in such a wonderful form. Huh? Neither a human being nor a lion. <laughs> wonderful. <laughs> and he killed. With his pointed nerves, not with any weapon, and putting on the lap, not in the land or water or sky, not inside room or outside room on the threshold, not daytime or night time in conjunction, day and night conjunction, <laughs> isn't it? You understand? Shirakan Kamakhali. Then when he killed, the Singhadi was men all became uh, stained with blood, looked red in his time, and it was appearing like a flower garland <laughs> around this chest of Singhadi. It seemed as if a lion has killed an elephant. You understand? With so many soldiers of pushing Hiranyakashipu, they all came out, fight against the Lord. But Lord, with his sharp nails, tore them. <laughs> they were killed. All the descriptions are there, you may read it. Lord Nisingadev's mouth and mane 
were sprinkled with drops of blood, mm. and his fierce eyes, full mm. of anger, mm. were impossible to look at. Mm. Licking the edge of his mouth with his tongue, mm. the Supreme Personality of Godhead, missing a day, decorated with a garland of intestines mm. taken from Hiranyakashipu's abdomen, mm. resembled a lion that has just killed an elephant. Elephant, yes. Mm. The, the Supreme Personality of Godhead, mm. who had many, many arms, mm. first uprooted Hiranyakashipu's heart mm. and then threw him aside mm. and turned toward the demon soldiers. Yes. These soldiers had come in thousands to fight with him mm. with raised weapons and were very faithful followers of Hiranyakashipu. Mm. But Lord Nisinghade killed all of them merely with the ends of his nails. Ends of nails, yes. Then they... The hair of Nisinghade's head shook the clouds and scattered them here and there. Yes. His glaring eyes stole the effulgence of the luminaries in the sky. Mm. And his breathing agitated the seas and oceans. Yes. Because of his roaring, all the elephants in the world began to cry in fear. Yes. Airplanes were thrown into outer space, mm. and the upper planetary system by the hair on Nisinghade's head. Airplanes were thrown into outer space and the upper planetary systems by the hair on the string of Dave's head. Mm. Because of the pressure of the Lord's lotus feet, the earth appeared to slip mm. from its position mm. and all the hills and mountains sprang up due to his intolerable force. Mm. Because of the Lord's bodily effulgence, both the sky and all directions diminished in their natural illumination, mm. manifesting a full effulgence and a fearsome countenance. Lord Masingha, being very angry and finding no contestant to face his power and opulence, yes. then sat down in the assembly hall on the excellent throne of the king. Mm. Because of fear and mm. obedience, mm. no one could come forward to serve the Lord directly. Next. Mm. Hiranyakashipu had been exactly like a fever of meningitis mm. in the head of the three worlds. Mm. Thus, when the wives of the demigods and the heavenly planets saw that the great demon had been killed mm. by the personal hands of the Supreme Personality of Godhead, mm. their faces blossomed in great joy. Mm. The wives of the demigods again and again showered flowers from heaven upon Lord Nisinghade mm. like rain. Mm. At that time, mm. the airplanes of the demigods, mm. who desired to see the activities of the Supreme Lord, Narayan, crowned, crowded the sky. The demigods began beating drums and kettle drums, mm. and upon hearing them, the angelic women began to dance, mm. while the chiefs of the Gandharvas sang sweetly. Yes. My dear King Yudhisthira, the demigods then approached the Lord. Mm. They were headed by Lord Brahma, mm. King Indra, and Lord Shiva, mm. and included great saintly persons mm. and the residents of Pitralok, Sinhalok, mm. Vidyadhara Lok, mm. and the planet of the snakes. Mm. The Manus approached, and so did the chiefs of various other planets. Mm. The angelic dancers approached, mm. as did the Gandharvas, mm. the Charanas, mm. the Yakshas, the inhabitants of Kinara Loka, mm. the Vaitalas, mm. the inhabitants of Kimpurusha Loka, mm. and the personal servants of Vishnu like mm. Sunanda and Kumuda. Mm. All of them came near the Lord who glowed with intense light. They individually offered their obeisances and prayers, mm. their hands folded at their heads. Mm. Yes. Lord Brahma prayed, My Lord, you are unlimited, mm. and you possess unending potencies. Mm. No one can estimate or calculate your prowess and wonderful influence, mm. for your actions are never polluted by the material energy. Mm. Through the material qualities, you very easily create the universe, maintain it, and again annihilate it. Mm. Yet you remain the same, without deterioration. Mm. I therefore offer my respectful obeisances unto you. Nusimhade was so angry, nobody could dare approach him, even uh, Lakshmi Devi couldn't approach. Uh. At last Brahma persuaded Prahlad Maharaj to go and pacify him. Uh. 
then Prahlad Maharaj went there. Carelessly, he was not least afraid of, always afraid. Prahlad was not least afraid of the law, just so dear devotee. Then he fell part at the lotus feet of Nasingadev. Then Nasingadev then put his hands, his lotus like arm on the head of Prahlad Maharaj. Huh? Then immediately Prahlad Maharaj got transcendental knowledge. Mercy. Then Prahlad Maharaj offered many prayers. Then you will read the prayers of Prahlad. Huh? That is in ninth chapter, seventh and ninth chapter. It is from the prayers of Prahlad Maharaj. Prahlad Maharaj prayed, How is it possible for me? Hmm who have been born in a family of asuras mm. to offer suitable prayers to satisfy the Supreme mm. Personality of Godhead. Mm. Even until now, all the demigods, mm. headed by Lord Brahma, mm. and all the saintly persons, mm. could not satisfy the Lord mm. by streams of excellent words, mm. although such persons are very qualified, mm. being in the mode of goodness. Mm. Then what is to be said for me? Mm. I am not at all qualified. Mm. Prahlad Maharaj continued, One may possess wealth, an aristocratic family, mm. beauty, mm. austerity, mm. education, mm. sensory expertise, mm. luster, mm. influence, physical strength, mm. diligence, intelligence, and mystic power, mystic yogic power. But I think that even by all these qualifications, one cannot satisfy the Supreme Personality of Godhead. Mm. However, one can satisfy the Lord simply by devotional service. Yes. Mm. Gajendra did this, and thus the Lord was satisfied with him. Mm. If a Brahmana has all twelve of the Brahminical qualifications, mm. as they are stated in the book called Sanat Sujata, mm. but is not a devotee and is averse to the lotus feet of the Lord, he is certainly lower than a devotee who is a dog eater but who has dedicated everything, mm. mind, words, activities, mm. wealth, and life to the Supreme Lord. Mm. Such a devotee is better than such a brahmana mm. because the devotee can purify his whole family, mm. whereas the so-called brahmana in a position of false prestige mm. cannot purify even himself. Mm. Yes. The Supreme Lord, the Supreme Personality of Godhead, is always fully satisfied in himself. Mm. Therefore, when something is offered to him, the offering, by the Lord's mercy, is for the benefit of the devotee. For the Lord does not need service from anyone. Mm. To give an example, if one's face is decorated, the reflection of one's face in a mirror is also seen to be decorated. Mm. Therefore, mm. although I was born in a demoniac family, mm. I may without a doubt offer prayers to the Lord with full endeavor, mm. as far as my intelligence allows. Mm. Anyone who has been forced by ignorance to enter the material world may be purified of material life if he offers prayers to the Lord and hears the Lord's glories. Mm. Like me, Devi, who is in the heart, chest, huh, of the law, cannot get it. Uh, it's very difficult and part of Lakshmi, the dear devotee of the Lord, very easily gets it. Mercy, the Lord. Uh. Is it equipoised, it is equal vision, the Lord has equal vision, Sanam Sarva Muti Sunam Indrasya Sprina Priya, said that thing in Bhagavad Gita. Uh. What is that English? Gita Samam Sarva Bhuti Sunam Indrasya Sprina Priya. Huh? All are required to me, all living entities. Nobody is dear to me, nobody is not dear to me, isn't it? So, so a bhakta, the bhakta is very dear to him. Vajan Sutumam Bhaktya. Huh? Do by Vajan in Bhakti, they are in me, I am in them. That will say that. Mercy is there in Srimad Bhagavad Gita. Huh? Bhakta Bhaktivati. Uh, though he is impartial, but he is very partial towards his devotees. But he is impartial. Yes. Bhakta Bhaktivati. 
So with these prayers, this level prayers of the Lord Maharaj. The one specific prayer, 7914. sarve rupam singha vibhaya janasvaranti. Seven nine fourteen. My Lord the Sringadev, mm. please therefore cease your anger now mm. that my father, the mm. great demon Harani Kashipu, mm. has been killed. Mm. Since even saintly persons take pleasure in the killing of a scorpion or a snake, yes, all scorpion the... and snakes should be killed. A saintly person kill them and get pleasure. Yes, other living entities. Sadhus never kill. Sadhus kill scorpion and snakes. And they get pleasure at this process, yes. Since even saintly persons take pleasure in the killing of a scorpion or a snake, mm. all the worlds have achieved great satisfaction mm. because of the death of this demon. Mm. Now they are confident of their happiness, mm. and they will always remember your auspicious incarnation mm. in order to be free from fear. Free from fear. Therefore, we always offer prayer. Huh? Namaste, Namaste, to be free from fear. And the Shingadev kills all in a speechless. The speechless comes in the path of devotion. Therefore, we offer no Shingadev. When you start joining, you also offer, you know, Fear, no obstruction, eh? no fearful conditions in there. Nothing that comes to the body, kill it. You understand? That will always. And this is devotees will always remember you, remember your prayer, free from all sort of fear. Yes. And 7925. Tasmat. Amastana Bhuta Mahamasi Sodhya Ayu Sriyam Vibhava Mahindriya Mahavirantya Nechamiti Vilulita Nurubikramena Kalat Gunapanaya Mangnija Bhutya Parsam My dear Lord, now I have complete experience concerning the worldly opulence, mm. mystic power, mm. longevity, and other material pleasures mm. enjoyed by all living entities mm. from Lord Brahma down to the ant. Mm. As powerful time, you destroy them all. Mm. Therefore, because of my experience, I do not wish to possess them. Mm. My dear Lord, I request you to place me in touch with your pure devotee mm. and let me serve him as a sincere servant. That is the prayer. Another prayer, 7944. Prayana Deva Munaya Sobi Mukti Kama, Monam Saranti Vidalena Brahmanista. Naitan Vihaya Krubanan Vimukyu Poeko, Nanam to the Sasaranam Brahmatan of a sea. When Nusina Deva put in Mukti, he refused. Why he refused? He says, That was 7 9 to 44. My dear Lord Nusingadev, mm. I see that there are many saintly persons indeed, mm. but they are interested only in their own deliverance. Mm. Not caring for the big cities and towns, mm. they go to the Himalayas mm. or the forest to meditate with vows of silence, mm. Mona Vrata. Mm. They are not interested in delivering others. Yes. As for me, however, I do not wish to be liberated alone, leaving aside all these poor fools and rascals. Yes. I know that without Krishna consciousness, without taking shelter of your lotus feet, mm. one cannot be happy. Yes. Therefore, I wish to bring them back to shelter at your lotus feet. Yes, yes. Now, Muni says they are all interested for their own deliverance. They go to Himalaya mountains, solitary places. Huh? Do Savana there, huh? So many severe studies are pronounced for them to go. But who thinks of the deliverance of the of living entities, even such uh, uh, Mletsas Javanas, those who are in the hellish planet in the Western country, in this hellish planet. So who thinks of who goes there and preaches Krishna consciousness and inculcates Krishna consciousness and through those Mletsas Javanas demons? Friends, a typical example, huh? <laughs> you warm in the stove. Who thinks 
them whose heart is so compassionate, so merciful. A Vaishnava like Guru Mahatma Maharaj. Yes. All right, nobody can do it. That is Vaishnava. Yes. His heart is so compassionate. Eh? So merciful heart he has for all living entities. Yes. Even worms in the stove. Yes. His heart. Yes. Another prayer, 750. Tate Arhattamana Mastati Karma Puja, Karma Smuti Sarana Yo, Sravanam Kadhayam, Sansavayatvai Vineti Sarangayakim, Bhaktim Janaha Paramahansagatau, Labheta. Therefore, O Supreme Personality of Godhead, mm. the best of all persons to whom prayers are offered, mm. I offer my respectful obeisances unto you, mm. because without rendering six kinds of devotional service unto you, mm. offering prayers, mm. dedicating all the results of activities, mm. worshiping you, mm. working on your behalf, mm. always remembering your lotus feet, and hearing about your glories, mm. who can achieve that which is meant for the Paramahamsas? Yes. 17. Nanyat dati akhila guru patita karunatvana jastha sishya sasti na sabhutya sabhaibani Prahlad Maharaj. 17. Otherwise, O oh my Lord, O oh, Supreme Instructor of the entire world, mm. you are so kind to your devotee mm. that you could not induce him to do something unbeneficial for him. Mm. On the other hand, one who desires some material benefit in exchange mm. for devotional service mm. cannot be your pure devotee. Mm. Indeed, he is no better than a merchant. Than a merchant. Yeah, does business with the law. I give you this thing, you give me this thing. Ah. <laughs> yes. Indeed. He is no better than a merchant mm. who wants profit in exchange for service. Yes. Then verse 6. Aham tu akasmastad bhaktastancha swami anapa sraya nanyati havo yur artho raja seva gariva. O my Lord, I am your unmotivated servant mm. and you are my <coughs> eternal master. Mm. There is no need of our being anything other than master and servant. Right. You are naturally my master, and I am naturally your servant. We have no other relationship. That's the prayer. Understand plenty. Then next verse. Jadi dasya si me kaman barastum brother saha kaman angudi asaraham abatastum ne baram. This is the only prayer you should offer. All should offer. Yes. O oh my Lord, best of the givers of benediction, mm. if you at all want to bestow a desirable benediction upon me, mm. then I pray for your Lordship that mm. within the core of my heart mm. there be no material desires. So, grab up in my heart. Offer this prayer. Yes. And then, if Lord grant it, then no more material desire. Huh? This is the prayer. Also, the offer. We have so many lusty desires. Yes. We'll root it out. It's also of a prayer and Lord has to be the law. Yes. The core of heart, please take away all these things from me. Any time, any condition, any substance, no material desire will crop up in my heart. Please give me this boon if you want to give me boon. That boon Prahlad Maharaj asked for. Yes. When Prahlad Maharaj, when Nusingadi was ready to give any boon he asked. Then this one next. Prahlad uh, Vasa, then text 15, 15, 16, 17, three verses. Barambaraya yatati varadi sana maheswara anan anindata pita metam vidvansti daiswaram vidya marsa saya sakya sarvaloka gurum prabhu dhatru hiti mrusa dusti stad bhakti maichagavam tasma pita me puyed dranta. Prahlad Maharaj said, O Supreme Lord, because you are so merciful to the fallen souls, I ask you for only one benediction. I know that my father, at the time of his death, 
had already been purified by your glances upon him. Mm. But because of his ignorance of your beautiful power and supremacy, mm. he was unnecessarily angry at you, falsely thinking that you were the killer of his brother. Mm. Thus, he directly blasphemed your lordship, the spiritual master of all living beings, mm. and committed heavily sinful activities directed against me, your devotee. Mm. I, wish that he, I wish that he may be excused for these sinful activities. He prayed for it, and for his father was And what the Lord said, text 18, Sri Sapta Vipita Puta Pitruhi Sati Anarha Jasa Dosya Kuli Jato Bhagavan Vai Kuro Pavana the Supreme Personality of God had said, mm. My dear Prahlad, mm. O most pure, mm. O great saintly person, mm. your father has been purified along with 21 forefathers in your family. Because you were born in this family, the entire dynasty has been purified. The dynasty has been purified. In the voice now, like Prahlad Maharaj, text about in his family, 21. Huh? Huh? Four fathers. Twenty-one four fathers. A course course. Huh? All become Delhi Hadis. Understand? Vaishnav Putra. A Vaishnav Putra. Huh? The son becomes Vaishnav. What he can do? If you want to procreate a son, son. Let's procreate some like the lot. Otherwise, why you procreate child? The hawks. Huh? Hawks procreate hundreds of children all in school. All in school. What is nonsense? Huh? If you want to procreate some, procreate some like the Lord. Yes, His father is glorified, his mother is glorified. The real father and real mother. Otherwise, they're not father and mother, they're hawks. Sea hawks. Yes. Only engaged in this uh, uh, sexual activities of sex and enjoyment, nothing else. Yes, procreating of nasty bastard children, or like children, probably it's tall, plus nonsense, huh? The husband is children, yes, hundreds of children, then why produce those children, huh? No need to produce children, you want to produce children, all right, you want to marry, all right, marry, produce children, a voice of son, like one, of yes. And fatherhood, motherhood is glorified. Yes, otherwise condemned. That's right. So there are some prayers, many prayers of Prabhupada Maharaj. So these prayers we should offer such prayers to the Lord. Especially you should offer. He has no more. Give me this boon on this day. Offer to Jagannath or the general of Prabhupada, Musinga Pad, who is no bad. Eh? Offer to him. Who is give me this boon, this auspicious day of appearance. No metal desire, lust desire, crap up in my heart. Please take it out of me. Understand? Yes. Vaisakasya tatrasyam suklayam srnukhi sari Jatas tatrasyam tat udhasavam kurvita sabratam Koting paddham puna Sanatam Goswami says This is the tithi day to day uh, month Vaisakha this is the fourteenth day of bright fortnight. Huh? This day, auspicious day, auspicious tithi, this single day appear. Therefore, in this very auspicious tithi, all devotees we observe it, we fast. Fasting should be there, yes. And offer prayers to so, Nusinga Dev. Prahlada Klesana Sayodahi Punya Tatudasi. This is this day, before offering worship to Nusinga Dev, first you should offer worship to Prahlad Maharaj is their devotee. Devotee should be first worship. And worship of devotees superior to direct worship of the Lord. Yes. We understand. Ah. And Lord appeared in order to protect his dear devotee, the persecution of his Demoniac father, Hiranyakashipu, yes. So first of all, we should 
After worship Prahlad, then we offer worship to Mr. Mother. This is the process. <coughs> so this is required that you should fast this day. This is brother. Don't eat. Fast. Little, like a little prasad on Kalpa, you may take. Mm. Brot, Nusinga mm. Puran mentioned there, Prahlad Maharaj asked Nusinga Deva how he develops such bhakti towards him. Mm. Answer to it. Nusinga Deva said, in ancient days, in Abhanti, there was a Brahman named Vasu Sarma, who is very Pandit, known as Veda. He had a wife, a uh, very good wife, devoted wife, just wife, endowed with all good qualities. Mm. She was celebrated uh, for her devotion to her husband. <coughs> Her name is Susila. She was Sarma and his wife Susila gave birth to five sons. Four sons were all learned, educated, they have all good behavior, uh, they are all obedient to sons, father. But the youngest son, you, pointing out. Prahlad's name was Vasudeva. Hmm, your name was Vasudeva. You are very bad character. You are bad character. You are addicted to prostitutes. Yes. Typical example. All prostitutes. Huh? All, all nasty bad character. Huh? One day you quarrel with the prostitute. You understand? Fighting? Um, yourself prostitute and yourself. So that night, both of you fasted because of quarreling and fighting. Yes. Fortunately, that day was my appearance for this day. And that too, both of you. <laughs> because of quarreling and fighting, you both of you fasted. So this auspicious day. This appearance day, my appearance day. Eh? So, you got such good eh, result, you got the result, a species result of fasting on my appearance day. <coughs> Both of you got, yes. That we should fast day today. You are born a son of Nusinga, I am say Hiranyakasipa, my dear devotee Prahlad, and that prostitute took bath in the heavenly planet, eh, as a heavenly prostitute there, of Sara and Joe, and she enjoyed so much material enjoyment she had there. After that, she became my devotee. Eh. And now you are the dear devotee of mine also, but though born in demoniac family. Mm. Observing my brother, Brahma is endowed with creative potency. Brahma observes this brother, Hiranya, this Nishinga Chaturdasi brother. And she also observes this brother, Nishinga Chaturdasi brother. Observing this brother, my appearance day, Sivaji got such strength and potency that he was able to kill that demon Tripura Asura. Yes. Those who observe my brother eh, and my appearance day, whatever eh, desire they have, they offer to me, I immediately grant them. Then is very merciful today, Nursinga Dev. Understand, Premji, you offer this prayer. And I say, please give me this boon of Nursinga Dev, all merciful Nursinga Dev, is auspicious day of your appearance. I have heard 
Uh, any time, any condition, any circumstances, no metal desire should crop up in my heart. Please, you grant me this boon. I want only this thing. Uh, and as I develop your devotion towards you, please grant me this. This only prayer you offer. All right? All of you should offer, yes. All of us also lust to do that, so much lust to do that. Yeah. And Narsinga Deva is very, very merciful today. Allah, so you'll definitely grant that boon to you. Bhagavan Narsinga Deva Ki Jai, Bhakta Prahlad Maharaj Ki Jai, Bhakta Prahlad Maharaj Ki Jai, Bhagavan Narsinga Deva Ki Jai, Gaur Pramanandi. So this time six now. I have finished though I have enough to say. Because other activities they have some of the other activities are up here. Activities are they have cussed me not go beyond six therefore I conclude it here and make my space very, 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 very soft. <laughs> no. Lord is unlimited, his katha is unlimited. Thank you very much. Love you. Develop devotion, pure devotion to Lord. And let all the obstacles in Asvinas, most peace of the Brahmin, part of devotion, be annihilated by Lord Nusinga Deva. Nusinga Deva ki! Singa Deva Ki, Bhakta Prahlad Maharaj.